progress progress luxury sport update update so we start ripping the shit out of here so we got this dash out of here and look what we find in the back of this motherfucker right here we got crossovers zip tied over there the computer brace right there and all this bullshit look at this look at this right here look you see that fire hazard all this shit man all this shit. All this shit. Not supposed to make sense of this shit. Look at this. Crossover zip tied. Shit right here. Man, this shit right here ain't no good, man. This is terrible. All this shit. I gotta make sure this shit gonna work. And then these gauges right here. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do about this shit. Cause I don't know if these motherfuckers is What's going on? What? This is just the beginning. And this came in just to get some me to put the pieces in. That comes to me. Come to the point that I got to put all this shit back together. And fix all this shit. I just called the customer. He said, go ahead. I ain't asked you to do it for the free free. So I'm like, wee wee. We're going to do it for the money. Not for the free free. But we got everything, man. We got this. And they cut the wires to the windows because they didn't have the door panels in, so they had to hot wire some shit. Man, this is a catastrophe. And y'all wonder why shit be taking so long. I know I'm pretty fast at doing the poultry, but that's the easy part. The, the hard part is putting this shit back together. And then if I don't do it right, they're going to blame every. If I hook the wrong speaker wire up, they're going to claim the whole motherfucking poultry job is fucked up. So that's why I be taking so long for me to get go through all people's shit. So... Y'all see what it is. So, got to get these seats out of here. Figure out how they got this console in here. Because this console is in this motherfucker tight. Little ass cup holders. Put sippy cups in this motherfucker. So, I got to figure out how to get this out. And then, I'll go from there. So, stay tuned. Step one. Strip all this glue and shit off these old ass pieces. Wipe them clean. Prep them and then start wrapping them with the red material. I already covered these with glue. Let that shit dry on there to make an even uniform base. I'm gonna let it dry for about 15 minutes before I try to stick it. But all this other one, I gotta get all this stuff off these other ones. So it's gonna be a long process. I gotta talk them to a bad deal, y'all. Got a spider. Ugh. Spiders. So we inside this G body, y'all. Monte Carlo. Luxury sport. Y'all see the dash is tore out. Wires is everywhere. So in the back, he wanna put four focal six and a halves in here. You see? So this is what we have the problem at. His box come all the way back I got it pushed forward a little bit now you can't there you go I got to push forward a little bit now so the focal speakers as you can see are kind of big so we're gonna have some clearance issues with this box but I'm gonna get them in there he might have to adjust the position of his box in that trunk. So, I got to cut this deck out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this top lip off like I just did. Cut this out. Cut it back here so two can fit. And I'm going to put the board in from the bottom and screw it in through here, this way, through this way, and through down. That'll hold the board in the car. So, we'll see what happens. Let's get it. Okay, so I made one uh, I don't know what the fuck I'm calling it because it's so hot I can't even think but one uh, template plate the whole focal so that's how it's going to go so I got to make another one for that side if I finish cutting that out and I had to, to see this slightly push forward a little bit because uh, see the gap because there's no way 
you're going to do it with that other, uh, with the seat smashed all the way back against the original position. So, I have to do a little modification to the seat frame, but it's in there. So now I'm about to make this shit and do what it do. I can't even think because I'm so damn hot. But y'all know what I'm talking about. Shit. So before I get to cutting, I figured I might as well make me a cardboard template like I always do. If it's not broke, don't fix it. So, made me a cardboard template how I want it to go. As you can see, I just gotta make a couple adjustments right here so I know it'll fit back behind that seat. But everything else will go straight back down in there. Cut the holes on that side. Then I can make it one piece. Then I make my speaker grills sit right on top. Uh, um, yeah, I do it that way. Because otherwise, mm -mm, it's too much work. So I'm gonna go ahead and make my one piece board. We go across, cut the holes out, countersink them a little bit, and then um, go from there. I just had a different idea. You know, I'm freestyle. So I'm freestyling, y'all. This is the only thing I gotta do back here before I can put all this shit in. Because everything is done for this back piece already. So I'm trying to get this car here. So stay tuned. All right, we're back in action. So Got the pieces made, but it seemed like I fucked up right there. And I cracked the one on this side. Right there. Ain't nothing little fiberglass won't fix to harden it back up. Cause I'm not cutting it over again. It was hell trying to cut this shit and then make it butt up in the middle like that. It was hell trying to get that shit together, but I got it. I kind of sunk the speakers down in there. So that's the main board right there. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna wrap them pieces and then make the speaker grill that goes on top. And you won't see the speakers in there. You had speakers in the side right there. The wires is what ran up the side, up through there. So I took them down. So I'm pretty sure he, gonna, he can just use them on there and then use the one on this side on there. And we be all good for the back deck. So I gotta think of something to go in the middle right there. I don't know what I'm gonna put right there. I have no idea. So, but I'm gonna wrap that red, fix that little spot where I fucked up on both sides, wrap it red, uh, screw it down in here, drop the speakers in, then I can put the speaker grills in on the top. And I think it's enough room under the bottom that I can drill up through the top. Through the, for the bottom with the drill to secure the speaker grill, everything be good. So the back is done. So all I have to do is put the shit in here and wrap these pieces. We have the back done. On to the next piece of this bitch. Okay, okay. Now I made some makeshift speaker grills. And I just laid them on top. So that's basically how it's gonna look. So wrap it with the mesh behind there. Four six and a half, four calves in the back. So we do. On to the next. So I did a test fit. See if this back seat gonna look all right. Y'all know what happened. I had to call him for reinforcements. <laughs> Big Mike! Yeah, we got to get this shit up out of here. So we snatching all this carpet up out of here. Because we tired of looking at this shit. It's time to take this shit forward another notch. So these motherfuckers got L brackets holding the carpet down. All type of shit. Man. What do y'all be getting these racing shifters for? I don't understand. You only can go 55 miles per hour legally. 75 if you're on the interstate. 40 miles per hour in the, on the street. So what the hell? Everybody want a race car. Don't no bitch want to be sitting in no car with no loud ass motor when she can't hear no love song. She want to hear no blah, 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 blah. Come on, man. And I know y'all do it for the bitches because I do it for the bitches. So let that sink in. But we finna get this carpet out. 
so we can start on the next process of this bitch. For uh, further inspection, we have some rust issues. Ain't that bad, it's surface rust, but you see you got a couple holes in right there. It's still solid, but over here we got more rust all the way through. So I'm gonna have to wire brush that. Come back with the fiberglass and then the undercoat and then put the pad down and put some carpet in this bitch. Alrighty then. So we about to install some new seat belts. See the ratcheting ones that goes right there. We got some brand new ones. Right here. So we gotta see if they gonna fit. Hopefully they fit. I don't know. We'll see. But get y'all seat belts, man. Y'all make sure y'all get seat belts. Otherwise, you're gonna have a, a brand new interior with some dark ass seat belts. But it's extra. So Get in where you fit in, because you don't have to have them. Because I take these bitches out, and you become an instant crash dummy. <laughs> <laughs> so, contacted the customer about his little rust issue. We're going to fix that. But he told me, look in the trunk. So y'all know what I found. Some of these big-ass, stupid-ass tweeters. But he got, these ain't the stupid ones. These just a little bit retarded. They ain't stupid. They still... Dumb as fuck. <laughs> these big, how many watts is these? Oh, okay, these are only 150 watts. Now, the mother was 5,000 watts, 6,000 watt tweeters. But these is all right. So, he want me to put these on the back deck somewhere. But I'm thinking about just putting them in the console and put the regular size tweeters in the back to make it more elegant looking. Because, oh man, I ain't trying to. He messed all that work I did to cut them pieces out to get that to fit like that. And you want me to fuck it up? I don't know. I don't think I should do that one. But I'll see what I can oh, do. Fuck it. Look in the trunk. He got another pack in there. So now he got four of them. So I'm going to have to put two back in the back deck. Two in the back. Two in the front. I got another box of speakers that he sent me. I ain't even opened that up yet. So hopefully he don't have no more in that box. Because there's going to be too many damn tweeters in this bitch. So I guess I do. Yeah, two in the back. Either two on the door or two on the console. So we'll see what it'll be. So I guess I gotta take that back apart and cut it, cut it and put it in the middle and then put another grill in the middle, I guess. I don't know. All right, y'all, we got the back deck done. Uh, I just put it in, see how it's gonna fit. Everything fits pretty good. I have to make a special thing for the tweeters to go right there because uh, he added the tweeters the last minute. And I have to make some modifications, but I fixed it. It looks good. So, side panels is wrapped. You see how that stitch is on there? So, you see that stitch? You see the stitch around the edge. That's how I suppose you're supposed to wrap. And I will be selling the templates for you guys. Do it yourself. Because if you want the template to wrap these, I will sell them $25. All you have to do is put it on the material and trace. And so, and you will be able to do it just like that. So, let me know. But it's thundering a lot of sides from the storm, so I'm about to go home. I'm going to shut it down for the night. I'll be in first thing in the morning, put the back of this car together. So we got to do a couple things, but it's going to be dope. Stay tuned. Bye, Howard.